Hello. I just wanted to let you know that I released a custom update for Echo RSS feed and starting from now you will be able to grab any custom attribute the feed or the feed items have. So you won't be limited by the standard uh, field items, you will be able to grab any uh, field item from the custom feeds. So let me exemplify this. For example, if we uh, take this feed, we can see that we have location tags in it. So, for example, this. This is a feed item and the feed item has location tags in it. For this is San Francisco. Okay, so if we want to grab the information from this tag, then we have to uh, proceed as follows. Go to plugin settings. Uh, in the latest update, you will see these two additional settings fields. <coughs> uh, if the uh, tag is located inside an item tag, like in this example, if the custom tag is located inside the uh, item tag, then you will have to enter it here. If it is directly in the feed, under the feed, uh, uh, it is a tag of directly of the feed, not an item, then you will have to enter it here. In our case, we have to use this feed item custom tag names list. And if I want to get this uh, location tag, I'll have to check first if I have an XML namespace. So if I have an XML namespace, then I have to enter it first. If this is not present, then you should enter only the location. But if you have a namespace like this, XML NS, then you have to enter it first, like this. This is the structure, structure if you have a namespace for the item tag. <clears throat> if you want to enter multiple uh, custom tags, uh, I have also a job number here, as you can see, this. This is also a custom tag. I have to copy the tag name and make a comma separated list of this. Also, the job number has also the namespace. So, I have to use also the namespace here. So, this is the syntax for custom item tag numbers. After I have entered this and save settings, now, I will be able to go to RSS to post, copy the feed URL here, only one post to make it faster, and now I will be able to use uh, the custom URL in this format. So copy it and enter the custom format name like this. So if I entered in the main settings this, here the short code will look like this to display the information that this grabbed. So this is the short code to display the Crelate location. Also, I have a Crelate job number to display that shortcode. Crelate job number, copy it and paste it here. And now let's make it look a bit better. Let's write the job location. Line break job number. Okay, we can also make this bigger to 
we can see better what we made and now we can simply save settings let's have a look at our blog it's empty and now let's generate a post it already got generated if we check it after the content we can see job location and job number if we search for this in the feed we will see that this is i think this is the job that we imported 153 153 yes this was the item that got imported okay so also uh, if you have custom feed tags that are directly under the feed not in items you can use the same syntax for uh, namespace and uh, field name but when using these in the short codes you have to use these like this instead of custom underline and uh, name space uh, and name you have to use feed here so custom underline feed underline namespace name and uh, item name this is all different from the item okay so using this update you will be able to grab any uh, custom information from the feed this is a unique feature on the market i don't think that this uh, feature is present in any other rss feed parser plugins so give it a try have it a look have a look at it and i hope you will enjoy it until next time bye bye oh and real quick i forgot that uh, you can also use these so these custom shortcodes will also be available <coughs> in the post custom fields so if you want to generate custom field with these shortcodes you will be able to do so and also for custom taxonomies so if you want to generate custom taxonomies with these you also will be able to do so this is all bye bye